I just woke up and I have that feeling that you get like in the back of your throat when you know like you know when you wake up and your voice isn't like completely there yet I'm at that I'm at that part right now I don't feel like my voice is completely here yet it may not even be here for the whole entire stream who knows but we are back with more Resident Evil 7. And where we last left off, we, uh, what do we do? We defeated Daddy Baker, right? Zoe had the fucking brilliant idea to say, use the syrup on him. And then we did it. And then she got mad because we had one syrup left. And then, you know, she made her choice. <laughs> she made her choice. She used her, do her dosage on her father, and now I'm claiming my reward, right? Come on. Like, after after I did all that, sorry, Zoe, but, uh, I came here for my wife. I guess, I guess I love my wife that much. I'd rather do all that work instead of just, you know, hop on Tinder or something to be like, yep, wife's been missing for three years. <laughs> but... Um, so we got out of the Baker State, right? Hopped on a boat, went into the bayou with all the crocodilies, and then, um, our boat got flipped over by a, by a goo monster crocodile, and then, uh, and then Ethan got dragged away, and now we're playing as Mia, and if I remember correctly, we do not have any, uh, items of self-defense on our person, so, uh, we are currently running for our lives in this abandoned ass uh, freighter, I guess. Is that what you would call it? Ship, freighter, the SS Ann. I don't know. Right? By the way, which begs the question how the fuck did a ship of that size get into the bayou? Like, the hole itself, isn't it like. Wouldn't it be, like, too big to go through the shallow waters of the bayou? Let's see. Hello, sir. I know you won't hurt me because I'm in the safe room. Oh, thank you. It has two shots. That's great. I would love it if I had some sort of knife. You know, help me cut those boxes. So, I know there's a, uh... There's a four-legged molded out there. Is there really nothing else in here for me? No knife or nothing? You gave me two shots and you said good luck? They said good luck. Keep it stepping. Don't get eaten. Don't get eaten. Don't get eaten. There's no way fucking... What is this? Small standard... Okay, it's a standard handgun. Fuck me. Sir, are you sure you ain't got no... No ammo in those pants. Nothing extra, nothing in the trash that I can I can scavenge and you know use. Alright, well I guess I'm gonna have to run past this guy. Huh! I don't hear it chasing me. I don't even see its shadow there. Does it... Did it just, like, disappear? Okay. That's not... Oh! There you are. Uh, you can stay over there, sir. You won't come in here, will you? Yeah, you will. Yeah, you will. Oh, this is not good. Fuck me. Yeah, Mia, you're gonna die. Huh. First time I saw that motherfucker go through a door. There's another one right there. We only have two bullets. Well, I only have... Damn it. Hmm. Alright, so a lot of running's gonna be had here. That's not a. That's not good. Oh shit. 
Mia can't like kick him or anything. Like give him a nice little swift kick. Kick him in their their gooey their gooey junk and keep it running. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. I know there was a in one of the rooms there was a baddie. In that room is a box that I can't break unless I, you know, take a shot at it, which I don't want to do. Uh, I guess I'll just... There's a room across, right? We'll just run for it. Fuck it, I gotta go through you anyways. Ow. Bastard. Anyone in here? Close the door, Mia. You just axing to die now. Got some psycho stimulants. What's this? It's too late for us, but at least I can I can let the world know what happened here. I was on night shift yesterday, so I was taking a nap in the bunk room around noon. I was half asleep and I heard a kid, a little kid, laughing. Or was it all in my head? I woke up at 1930, military time. There was some sort of ruckus in the passageway. Drew, one of the engineers, came in and said there was something going on down below. Maybe a riot? He looked pale in the face. He told me that he was going to check it out, but he never came back. It must have been around 1950 when I heard a scream, went to the laundry room and checked and I saw Clark being eaten by some sort of blackish monster. The monster turned and started started coming towards me, huge shark-like teeth snapping it, snapping in its jaw. I just screamed like a little girl and ran for it. Now I'm huddled up in a bunk room, shaking as I write this. There's a hole. Wow, for someone who was shaking as they wrote this, you wrote it pretty clearly. Uh, shaking as I write this. There's a host of... There's a... Wait, what? There's a whole host of the creatures lurking in the passageway now. I can still hear screams now and then, but there's no way I'm going out there. And that's it. I've written everything I know. Giovanni Fit Finetti? Giorno, Giorno Giovanna? That man had a dream. Listen, I don't want to... Do they really want me to shoot this? Well, what's the worst that can happen? The worst that can happen is I get no bullets. But I do have first aid now. What is it? Is it regular first aid? I can't even check my health. Because Mia doesn't have anything on her. Hmm. We have psychostimulants, but what's the point of doing that if I don't have a knife or anything that I can use? So, I'm assuming this is the bunker? There's probably a dead guy in here somewhere. M. Some River Cruise. Is there a knife in here I can take? Come on, there's gotta be something in here. There's no way you just sit on the floor with nothing for me. Is that not like a fuse or something I can rip out? Bastard. Someone gonna jump out at me? I'm not a fan of this. Whole lot of nothing. Dear Janet, how's it going? I guess half a year or so will pass by the time you get this letter. Life is so boring here, day after day, it's just the same old sea. See, you out here in the bayou now, with the crocodilies. Although there's one thing that's different. This time we have some passengers sailing with us, which hardly ever happens. It's a couple, it's a couple with a little girl. I think they're distant relatives of the captain. Imagine traveling on a tinker instead of passenger ship. It must be hard. Yeah. I tried talking to the little girl earlier, and her dad shot me this nasty look. What's what? What are they so worried about? That I think about it, the captain said he didn't even have any relatives. Maybe I'm overthinking this. I miss you. Love, Jim. Earthworm Jim. I've never played Earthworm Jim. I should do that one day. I'm not sticking my head over there. I'm going to 
Something's going to come and bite me. Okay. There's a room over there. That leads back into the room with the monster in it. And then there's a other room. Uh, no, it's not really... It's really scary when you have nothing to defend yourself with. So I'm just going to hightail it. Oh, fuck, it's locked. Of course it's locked, you bastards. Well, I'm going to run in here real quick. Guess I'll, uh, use a... Wait, what the hell? What's that? Oh, I need a lockpick for that. There's items over there. Thought I closed this door. Oh. Handgun ammo, thank you. What about... In here? I know there's a dude in here. Okay. Come on. I'm gonna need you to go down, sir. I'm gonna need you to stop. Ain't no way that killed you. Chem fluid. Okay. That just leads out. Okay, I'll take that. Gunpowder. Um. Wait, what? What is this? Machine gun ammo? Oh, shit. Well, then. Right now, I'll just take more health. How about that? We'll do that. Okay, we are on the first floor. Hello? Is anybody... Is anybody home? I promise I won't shoot you if you just come out nicely and leave me alone for the rest of the duration of my stay. I was locked from the other side, okay. I'm hearing monsters. I'm hearing the spookies. They're being scary. Oh, that's openable. Okay. You're not, you're not giving me any confidence here. Make me worried. All right, now. That's, uh, that's not nice. Why would you do this to me? Hello, child. Watch Hi. What? what? Why? You need to remember, so we can be a family. Okay, I'll watch it. You're not gonna, you're not gonna stab me in my back, are you? Old videotape. It's all gooped up. Why'd you goop up the videotape? See, look, child, I'm watching it. T test subject, E001. Okay.
My throat is like super fucking dry. I need to take a drink of water. Alan, you're getting worse. And she must have infected me during the attack. Yeah, I'm too far gone anyway. Alan, your watch is telling me you're in danger. It's my fault she got out. Yeah, it is your fault. But that doesn't mean I'm going to let you die. She didn't attack you? It's part of her imprinting protocol. I can't believe this is happening. Here. Take. It has her tissue sample. I can find her. I'll fix this. Okay, Evie. Where are you? Okay, Evie. Where are you? Just a picture of a dude hanging on top of my bed. I don't know who he is, but he's there. Special Opera uh Special Operations Division Director Alan Droney and caretaker Mia Winters. Okay. Recent reports suggest that if Evelyn remains at her current location, she's at high risk of being stolen by opposing organization. Their orders, therefore, are to transfer Evelyn to our Central American branch for safekeeping until further notice. During transfer, be sure to adhere to the following protocols. Act as a parental guide, uh, guide uh, blah, 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 blah. Act as a parental guardian for Evelyn at all times to avoid suspicion. Manage Evelyn's vitals via the genome codex provided. If the mission is compromised beyond rec uh, reconciliation, dispose of Evelyn. We about to go kill a kid today. That's what's about to happen. Do I have anything in here for me? Oh, what? I'm just carrying. I'm just carrying a machine gun. And I got a survival knife. Hey, Alan, check this out. Poke. Oh, shit. I thought it would let me do it. Damn, Mia. Why are you packing heat? Heh. <laughs> okay. It's locked from the other side. That's cool. Listen, I got a gun. What? She's close. The number displayed shows the distance to the target. Okay. Gun's gonna come grabbing me out the corner, right? Hello? Evelyn. I'm here to... Dispose of you. Now, I know that sounds like something that's bad, but trust me, it's not. It's all good. What the hell is this? It's all good. Me disposing of you just means that we're going out for a walk. We'll take you to a nice park. We're going to look at the sunset. And then I'll read you your favorite bedtime story. Doesn't that sound nice, Evelyn? She's gonna jump scare the shit out of me, ain't she? Evelyn! I'm here to be your friend. What? Why does it say she's further away now? What? Okay. Better check the rest of the first floor. Alright. If that's what you want me to do, it's telling me she's getting further away now. Like, by a lot. Evelyn, where the hell are you? You know, Mama Mia's, uh... Mama Mia, wow. I can't believe I just said that shit. You know... Mother Mia is, uh, is worried for your safety. It says she's right here. Am I on the first floor? I'm on the second floor. How do I get down? How do I get down with my bad self? Nothing in the garbage, right? 
Okay, just making sure. Are these the steps? Locked from the other side. Evelyn. Supplements. Huh. Evelyn. Oh, come on, girl. What you doing? What you doing making me go through crawl spaces? You know, that makes me uncomfortable. Especially when things are pulsating and shit. Baby girl, is that you? Are you... Vomiting, that's what you call vomiting? You unlocked it. Ba baby girl. We'll have to reset. How's it going? She's vomiting. Far more in excess of her body mass. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> We're gonna be seeing a lot more of her ugly friends if this keeps up. <laughs> Alright. We need to find her and fast. This is getting out of hand. Agreed. Okay. So, uh, do I just leave this alone? Find Evelyn. I, I guess this isn't... Alright. We'll just leave that over there. Hello? Okay. I'm getting further away from her now. Now I'm getting closer. Is this door supposed to be open? I thought it would close. Fuck. Way to scare the shit out of me. Ellen, your friends are being mean to your mother. Okay, it's dead. All right. Evie, come here. Why are you running? Come on, girl. Mother's worried about you. Your friend tried to hurt me. Damn, Mia, you need some fucking lotion or some shit, girl. You're pale as fuck. Son of a bitch. Alright, Evelyn, that wasn't nice. That was very mean. I don't know why you would do that to me. But I don't appreciate it. Second floor, or, oh wait, we are on the second floor. Just, uh, don't worry about that. <laughs> Evelyn. Oh, shit. Evelyn, I ain't got time for this bullshit, and you know it. You're going to be in so much trouble. You hear me, young lady? You're going to be grounded. Grounded for life. Ah, fucking shit. See what you're doing, Evelyn? You're hurting me. You're causing me pain. Both physically and emotionally. Alright, let's stop with the fucking- let's stop with the fucking jump scares now. this fucking gun. Make quick work of these bastards. 
Evelyn, oh my god, now you're further away from me. That means you're just running away. You're being a jackass, Evelyn. It's not nice. Here I am worried about you and you're, uh, you're fucking about. Evelyn, did you kill that nice man? Oh, where the fuck? Okay. Is there another one being brought to life? That's just the one. All right. That solves that problem. Is he getting back up? <laughs> Is he getting back up? Can't have none of that now. What about this guy? Is he gonna turn? You better not grab me. I'll fucking... I'll judo chop you. I'll use my sick fucking kung fu moves on you. Evelyn, you're not making this easy for me. Baby girl, you're not making this easy for me. I'm really scared. You're scaring me. I'm startled. I guess you're in this room then. Fuck me. I can't get in there. All right. Ellen, I think she's on the other side of this door, but I don't have a key. Try to melt down the lock. You're on the bottom level, right? Check our luggage. Our luggage. Where the fuck is our luggage? Is it further in? Chem fluid. Okay. I'm not going to be attacked, am I? Am I going to be attacked? Uh. Okay, seems safe so far. What the hell is this? Corrosives. Alright, Ellie, you leave me no choice. Evelyn. Are you mad at me, Mommy? No, Evie. I I'm not mad. Wait. What did you call me? I'm a little mad, Evie. I have to say. I don't want to live at the lab anymore. I want a house. And I want you to be my mommy. Okay, Evie. I I'll be your mommy. Just, just come back with me. Right now. Okay? Oh shit. Where are you, Evie? You're fucking up my watch, Evie. Evie, you're fucking you you're tearing you make me scared. You know ha Evie? Don't Don't <laughs> Come on. Evie, wait. You're not you're not funny. She ran off. She's making more friends, Alan. Those things are everywhere. I told you so. <coughs> are you okay? You just worry about getting Evelyn back. Yeah, Alan, you're you're fucking dead, bro. Evie. You're not gonna turn on me, right? Oh what the fuck? Oh, there's more of them. You guys, you stay back. You stay back. You stay back. Well, I'll just run past you. I should be fine. 
Amy, where the hell are you? What the fuck I just picked up? I just picked up some bombs? Remote bomb. Hmm. And I'm at what? Yellow? Alright, shit. Well, we gotta go regardless. Come on, open up. I don't know if this is the right way or not, but... It's the only thing I can do. Oh, uh, fuck. You stay over there. Don't you dare. You're still fucking alive. Get sliced up. Get sliced up. Yeah, that's right. Uh, there's more. Oh, more bombs. God damn, there's a lot of bombs on this fucking ship. Um. Okay. Fuck this room. Oh, come on, Evie. What the hell did you do? How do I... Still alive? I'll take that as a no. Oh, fucking hell. Evie, you're making mother angry. You don't like mommy when she's angry. Evie! God damn it. Come on. Evie, no more of this elevator jump scare bullshit, okay? Floor three. Okay. Floor three. Third floor. Whatever. All right. Emergency safety lockdown system has been engaged. All right, Evie. That's not cool. You're not cool for doing that. Making life more difficult for me. That's what you're doing. Goddamn child. Is this, uh... Oh man, Alan's turned, didn't he? Alan, you turned in here? You dead? Damn it. Evie's upstairs. Oh shit. Yep, Alan's dead. Alan? Alan, where the hell are you? Alan is... Dead and gone. He ain't gonna be in Rush Hour 3. Is there nothing in here? No extra bullets for me, Alvin? Gotta go the long way, because that's blocked off. Fine by me. Give me something good in here. Bombs. Okay, I'll take those. Why not? Evie. Fucking hell. Ah, fucking shit. Is this more bombs? Yeah, more bombs. Okay. Locked from the other side.
Evie. Mommy's here. Gonna take you home, okay? Do I... Am I supposed to be going this way? Evie. Oh, there's two of them. Okay. Alright. Man, I love this fucking machine gun. It's beautiful. Sorry, what? Climb up. Oh, shit. Really, Evie? You're making this really difficult for me. <laughs> Guess we just shoot people in this house, huh? House? We're in a ship. Evie, where you at? The more work you make me do, the angrier I get. And the more destruction I feel like I need to rain down upon you. <laughs> That's how they did Osama. They just they just bust his ass. You burn him at sea. Oh fuck. Evie. Oh, there's a door over there. Okay. Anything? Anything in here for me? Like some uh, ammo or something? That would be. I'll be appreci- you know, I would appreciate that. I guess not. Oh hey, it's- it's, uh, Evan. I almost forgot his fucking name. Hold up, Evan. Let me just check over here and make sure, uh... Make sure there's nothing I'm missing. Is this a box? Can I- Hey buddy, how you holding up? Damn, dude. You have to fight her. Hey, you badmouthed her. That's your fault. You fucking did that to yourself. Evelyn, stop. Stop right now. Don't touch me, don't. I will look up, but the game won't let me. <laughs> okay, well that was... Well, that's how... That's... That's something. Oh, and then I guess you infected Mia? Oh, shit. Oh, now she's in my head. Oh, fuck. Evelyn! It's not right to possess your mother. You stop it right now. Oh, it's the scene from the beginning of the game. But her arms are all goopy. Right. 
I did lie to you. I shouldn't have, but... All I can say is that if you get this, stay away. Forget that you ever knew me. Have a good life. All right. I really wish that they just used me as in-game character model for the cutscene, because whatever the fuck that model is that they use for that, it looks... She got, like, the world's weakest chin. <laughs> it's kind of weird. It's like she's, like... Like, putting her chin in when she's doing that video. Oh, fuck! What? You sure there's no bullets over here? <laughs> Just make sure. Okay. You know, I would feel more confident if I didn't have 15 bullets. Oh, fuck this noise. Evie. This isn't a good thing to do. Oh, fuck! We'll be together forever. Wasn't even a monster, it was a regular dude, and I just started shooting at him. Okay, but how did they get to the bayou? <laughs> you tell me, you tell me Evelyn just like took over the controls of the ship and just crashed into the bayou? I don't think that, I don't think that ship would fit in the swamp. Water's too shallow. How shallow is the water? It's so shallow that... On its Tinder profile, it only wants people who are six foot and up. Can we be a family like before? No, Evie. Like before? You try to kill me. We were never a family. We will never be a family. Then I don't need you anymore. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Wow. That was unnecessary, but you got me. Oh, hey, look. A save point. Huh. Well, don't mind if I do. There we go. Okay. Guess I'm just gonna keep going this way. Wait, how much? I still don't have the, uh, machine gun. And I'm gonna assume that it'll probably be somewhere over here, right? Yeah, I'm not going through there yet. Oh, what's this? Uh... Something toxin? What is this? E-neurotoxin? Or something like that? Destroy any subject, bio, something. What the fuck? Okay. Contents have been taken. Is my gun in here? I would like to have something that goes a little pew pew. I need a lockpick for that. Machine gun ammo. You're giving me machine gun ammo, but I have no machine gun. Gunpowder. Chem fluids. Well. Guess I'm doing that. I have something. Make me feel safe. Oh, there's my laptop. 
Looks broken. Oh, you think? Oh, I need, uh, need to melt that with some corrosive shit. Okay. Oh, wait, did I run past the... Here it is. I better not get no fucking ladder jump scare. Climb the ladder and then there's someone just up there staring down at you. That shit's terrifying. Okay. Hmm. Ha! Alright, this is a new area. I haven't been here before. Oh, look at that. That surely will activate some sort of cutscene that will make all the monsters come after me. Gunpowder. And nothing. Alright. I still don't have that. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Way to scare the hell out of me. Um. Hmm. All right. works. Maybe I'll get jump scared. Ethan. I hope I make it in time. Okay. Bottom level. Oh fucking hell. Fucking hallucinations. Where is she? Hallucination my ass. I felt that one. <laughs> Alright, well, fuck, guess I'm going, uh... Which way are we going? Looks like something important over there, so... Guess this is the way I'm going. Well, I can check in here, right? Oh, wait, no, that's... Wait. What the fuck? That's a save room up ahead. Right? Oh, it's blocked off. Oh, but there's a bomb. I can use that. And this just leads back around, right? Yeah, okay. Wait, what? I will take that. Captain's cabin. Oh, well, there's my gun. If only I had a lockpick. Or a key, or something. Map. A lug wrench. What the hell am I going to use a lug wrench for? Can I bash my way into here with it? <laughs> Fucking son of a bitch. Alright. Well, we'll get a, a key for that or something, right? Hmm. 
My fucking analog stick is acting up. I just closed that back up for no reason. This isn't, uh... Okay. I'm waiting for them to jump scare me on this fucking ladder. That's what's gonna happen. I feel it. I feel it in my bones. I just going they just go into a big circle. Oh, that's how I get oh Okay. All right. Well then uh Looks like we can head upstairs. Quick question. Go ahead. Am I really... Can I really not go through there? Can I not, like, push this out my way? Alright, well, shit. Guess we'll head downstairs then. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna head back downstairs. All the dumb shit on the boat. Why don't we just get off the fucking boat? Because our husband is here. And he's got... He got get... Here's the thing. We're playing as Mia. She's uh, Ethan's wife. Who we literally just spent the first half of the game saving. So basically our main character... Basically we're at the role reversal here. Our main character has been taken. And now we're playing as the woman he just saved. And... She better damn well come and go after Ethan. <laughs> you know what? I'm a widow now. See, that's what ha that's what I would think, like, in the beginning of the game when you played as Ethan going after her. But now, we saved her. Bitch. Alright, Lewis, the cable is... <clears throat> the cable is completely fried. We had a replacement, but if we, if we had to use... What? But we had to use it to fix something in the third floor sick play. All right. By right, Dr. Waddle. Waddle. Need... All right. I need it down in the second engine room. Okay. Cool. And what the hell is this? A fuse and... Two fuses. Okay. But, um... Yeah, Ethan came and saved Mia... Right, and now we're playing as Mia because we got we got attacked on our way out. Look at this man, he's making love to himself. That's what you do. You just you just turn around, hug yourself, and start making kissy noises. He's making out with himself. That's what he's doing. Alright, he's done. Yeah, but after Ethan did all that shit to come and get Mia, she better fucking turn around and come save my ass. <laughs> who's giving me, who's giving all the Russians guns? They're not Russians. Special Operations Division. Okay, this is uh this is what the room they uh used to be in. They're not Russians. If I have to make a an educated guess here, which I shall. I would say that Mia worked for Umbrella. And Evie is some type of bioweapon. And then Evie broke loose. Took control of Mia for like three years. And then I guess Evie found out about Ethan and coerced him to come and save Mia. 
so that she can have her little family that she wants. Oh. <laughs> the guns are Russian. Well, I would assume Russia would make their own guns, right? You unlocked it. Wait, unlocked it? Where, where the hell is this? Second floor. And where do I need to go? He said... Where did that thing say? It said the third floor, right? It said on the third floor they needed a... They needed something. Wait, hold up. Did I miss... Break room, dining room. Yeah, let's go. Let's go over there see what we can grab. Hello? Anyone home? Oh, look at you. I only got five. You know what? Fuck it. Oh, shit. That's not good. Uh! Still alive? You don't seem like it. And this is blocked off, so I can't climb through there. Let's see, holding a Makarov right now. Shit, you had earlier was a cylindrical magazine. Oh damn, that's too much mumbo jumbo for me. <laughs> I don't know nothing about no guns, but nice to know. Keep giving me fucking ammo for the machine gun, but I uh, I don't have the key or the lock pick or whatever I need to open that open that uh fucking cage or whatever so I can get the damn thing there's the lounge which we go in through the break room got plants growing up in the fucking Oh, shit. What's this shit all about? It's abstract. And it's beautiful. It won't open. Oh, there's more over here. Fuck. See? <laughs> Motherfucker had you earlier. <laughs> you reload at the bottom of the gun. <laughs> Can I flip these over? Oh, wait, no. I just gotta, okay, just gotta make them the same, like that, oh wait, I got it, corrosives, nice, I guess I can use the corrosive on the, um, on the, uh, whatchamacallit, the cabinet, there's a bunk room, Oh, fucking hell. God, way to scare the ever-living shit out of me, and I'm missing every shot known to mankind. That's great. It's alright, man. Come on, bring it. Bring it. We play Ring Around the Rosie. It's okay. Now you stay your ass in here. You think about what you did. Chem fluid. Okay. Gunpowder. <laughs> Fuck, that guy scared the shit out of me. It was amazing, though. Abstract, how about you? <laughs> how about you extract your ass from this motherfucker boat? Exactly. I'm trying to do, but listen, we can't leave without Ethan. And the only reason I say that is because I played the first half of the game as Ethan, and that motherfucker did everything for his wife. So if she were to leave my ass now, I'd be hella mad. Like she was gone for three years. I 
Ah, Captain's Cabin Key. Thank you. Let's see. Die so he can get out the fuck off the boat. Hell no, Ethan's not gonna die. He better not die. Even if he does die, fucking Mia still got... She still got Evelyn in her in her fucking head. Yeah, we're using this. Get those enhanced bullets. So if if Ethan wants to just like die right now, right? Then Evelyn would still win. Mia won't be able to go home. Where does this lead? To the third floor, that's where we have to go. But I wanna head I want to head back so I can go and grab uh go and grab that uh that gun. Who the fuck's Evelyn? The kid. <laughs> She's the kid doing all this crazy shit. This is regular bullets, right? Oh man, I really hope that was regular bullets. Now how the fuck do I get back, uh, through the, through the elevator, right? Go get my fucking gun. Cause that's what I need. You better be kidding if you're rolling around with a machine gun and shit. Letting adolescents fuck with me. She's a super mutant. What do you mean? She's the one creating all these monsters and shit. You think you think you're just gonna let her run around like that? Come on, she's gonna fuck the whole world. Oh fucking shit. Ow fucking hell. Let me heal first, damn it. Put that juice all over my body. Bastard. Oh shit. <laughs> Way to scare the absolute fuck out of me. Oh captain, my captain. You can you cannot. How about that? You can just stay over there. You can just you can just not do that. Oh, captain, my captain. Now I feel safe. Alright, so... Over here is where we go... Back? How do I not break my ankles after that? I don't know. Also, I need some sort of chem fluid because I have no health. No healing items. Okay, so where are we going again? We're heading to... Third floor sick bay. Survival knife? Oh, shit. I know I left you alive. Bastard. Yeah, go scare somebody with that shit now. How about that? Alright, so, this will, well, we can head over here. There's the, uh, ladder that we can take. I'm assuming this will take me to sick bay. Man, it's dark as fuck up here. Oh, look at this. We got some bombs. We got the bomb diggity. That's right. And a lockpick. Everything's coming up. Oh, fucking hell. Everything's coming up, Melhouse. Oh, 
What happens when you get too preoccupied with the Ethan dude? You get fucked up by the Quap zombie. <laughs> Quapping his way through. Stuck in a motherfucking boat with plant zombies. Alright, well, shit. If you want to be stuck with plant zombies, go play Resident Evil 2. Especially Resident Evil 2 Remake. That's where they got the plant zombies. What's it called? Plant 42 or some shit? Oh, Captain, my Captain. I am here. This is a safe room. We are safe. Oh, okay, that's where I would use the lockpick. Alright. Hmm. He ain't trying to be stuck with shit. Trying to be crushed to death by the RE by the RE8 dumb mommy. Exactly. We all want to be crushed to death by Lady Dimitrescu, right? That's a real woman. That's a woman I need in my life. So we we all need her in our life. I feel like um I feel like when it comes to RE8 and like Lady Demitrescu, oh fuck me. Alright, well he put up no fight whatsoever. When it comes to Lady Demitrescu, I think I feel like she's only gonna be in like one part of the game. And then we're never going to see her again. <laughs> okay, there's that. And what about over here? Antique coin. Got some money. It's all worth it because we got a coin. There's sick bay. And then there's the shaft. Can I not open this door? Oh, fuck me. Are you serious? Alright, well, fuck. <laughs> Before we head through there, I will be right back because I gotta go use the bathroom real quick. So please give me... Please give me about, like, a minute or so.
We are back. I drank too much goddamn water for my own good. Lately, I've been, I've been running to the bathroom more frequently. Got to cut down on that. Wait, no, not not retry. Let's not do that. All right. <laughs> Increase the shit they're putting in the water. <laughs> oh God. People tend to forget that Ashley in RE4 is fucking 20 years old. Right? They still treat her like it's legally blonde or some shit. I mean, the dead giveaway is like, once you run into Lewis, the first thing he says is like, Wow, the president equipped his daughter with some, uh, ballistics. And she's like, you talking about my titties? Stop talking about me like that. Don't do that. That's bad. He's gonna come busting out the bathroom. Watch. He's gonna come running out the bathroom. The monster's gonna be like, oh boy, you shouldn't go in there. I stunk up the place. Alright. What the fuck and where the fuck? Oh, okay. Well, we're not having any of that. Absolutely not. How do I... Where do I... Huh! Eh. You can have that to yourself, buddy. Take that. I think that's unhealthy. You should be vomiting that much. Oh, fuck! You're still alive? Holy shit. I need to, like, get somewhere. Did he die? Oh. Only got a couple of bullets in. Okay. I still have no... No healing items. I can't just use... I can't just use this by itself, can I? Oh, I can! <laughs> Start eating that fucking herbs. Put the plant in your mouth. <laughs> they gotta be putting some shit into the water or milk or something. That boy needs some milk. <laughs> what is that? Where is that from? I just remember hearing that shit. Oh, here's the chem fluid. Damn. Got strong chem fluid. Regular chem fluid. You know what? I'm gonna just use them both on on that. I'd rather have healage. You know what I mean? Put that juice all over my all over my hand. What is that shit like? Aloe vera or some shit? Can you, can you not open the door? All right, well, thanks a lot for that. Thanks for nothing. So we got this shit. We just need to make our way back. You're going to come popping out the stall, aren't you? I feel it. Huh. Surprised they didn't come attack me. What about over here? Going to have like some sort of flying creature? This is a big ass ship. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like multiple ships. Come on, where's the jump scare? You know you want to do it, game. You're going to come out this door? Huh! All right. <laughs> Leaving me all anxious and shit. You know, the more I play this, the more not excited I am for uh for Halloween this year. Cause Lord knows I'm gonna have to play some spooky shit. And I got a couple of ideas. Where's the uh where's the fuck it wait what? Am I blind? Excuse me? Missing the few. Where's the, uh... Where's the shit that I just went and grabbed? Did I not pick it up? Excuse me? <laughs> Gonna 
call it night. All right. Thanks for thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. Just chatting it up out here. I think I left the uh whatever those cables were. I think I left them behind. Let me check this shit again. Did I just like leave it on the floor or something? Better stay in that fucking stall. Did I really just like leave this shit behind? Oh, wow. I gotta pick it up after. What the fuck? <laughs> now he's gonna pop out the stall, aren't ya? All right, game. You test my patience here. Gonna come popping out the door. Yeah. I'm calling bullshit. Something's gotta attack me soon. It's too goddamn quiet in here. Here we go. There's one. And now I just need a fuse, which should be what, on the second floor? You need it down in the second engine room. Okay, and where's the engine room? Cargo bay, engine room. Ah, oh, fuck me. Alright. Stairs are this way. These are the steps, right? Okay. I'm doing what you want me to do, game. Playing by your rules. Oh, fuck that. Oh, this is the... Revenge is a dis best served cold. How the fuck am I missing? Every shot known to mankind. Ow! Bitch! Yikes! That's... That's resilient, son of a bitch. Alright, cool. Damn. I tried to use the first aid on me, but she wouldn't do it. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? Maybe I can just use the handgun, right? This is after I use the, uh, stuff, right? Cool. We can use the handgun. Maybe get a good shot in. Where's my health us, by the way? Oh, I can't even check my fucking health. I don't have the watch. Ethan has the goddamn watch. Just gotta have a feel for what I'm doing. There you go. Should be a second one around here. Can I just take this fuse? Nope. See, this is where you put your fucking foot in the door, Mia, and you just grab the fuse and you go. Need a lockpick to get that far. And there's a dude over here. Come on, jackass, where are you? I need you to turn around so I can get a good shot. Or I can just shoot him right up the ass right now. Perfect. Beautiful. I'll keep, you know what, I'll keep the super bullets on. How about that? There 
There we go. Don't mind if I do. Where's the catch? It's gotta be some sort of catch in here, you know? Gonna come popping out of out of the ceiling or some shit. Okay. I call bullshit. But you know what? I won't complain too much. Alright, then we head straight down, right? We can go through that door. We can go through here, right? This wouldn't be a problem? Well, that's a problem. Huh. And this is as low as we can go right now, huh? Hmm. How would I... Oh, there's a room. There's a room this way. Can we not go in here? Climb up. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, wait, this is where we, uh... Oh! Wait, so can I, like, slide down if I wanted to? No? Alright, well, fuck. How would I... Oh! Oh, wait, why am I climbing back up? It said press circle to go down. Go down. I see what I can do. My brain just being stupid. I'll take that with me. And up I go. See, now you're thinking what portals. All right, where the fuck do I go? Awesome. We're heading down to, uh... Okay. We're heading down to, um... Hmm. Nothing on the first floor for me, right? The office is just nothing. Don't worry, Ethan. We're coming to save you, buddy. We are coming to save you. Slowly, but surely. There's a big-ass fucking... hole we got down here. Waiting. Fuck you! He's waiting, she says. I'm waiting to put my fucking foot up your ass when I see you. Make me go through all this dumb shit. What? I see you! Beat all creepy and shit. Alright, good. Good, good, good. Is it gonna come from behind me? I got great spatial awareness. Oh, 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 no. You start choking. Handgun ammo, I will take that, thank you. 
no secret uh jump jump scares or anything you're not gonna jump from the ceiling and grab me yep you jump from the ceiling Grab these. I'll grab that. <laughs> Just making sure they're not putting any bodies in here. One can't be too careful. Oh, look at this. I almost missed that. Take my sweet ass time. Now, where are you guys? There's no way. There's no way that there's not going to be any sort of monster in here. What the hell is this? Oh, more ammo. Look at you. It's gotta be another one. This can't just be one in here. Come on. This room is too goddamn big. Oh shit, that's a bad one. You can just have that. Some of this. Actually, I gotta pick that one back up. Did he just blow that up? Hey, bastard. Come back here. Jackass. I think that's enough for you. Oh, is he dying? He's dying. Cool. I'm not sure if he, like, like, detonated them himself to, like, to not get hit by it, or if he just, like, if it just, like, blew up by itself and did damage. That was kind of confusing. Handgun ammo. Or as I like to call it, worthless. Why am I going through my menu like that? What the hell am I doing? What if he just got up and started doing the twist? He just started dancing? That'd be kind of funny, I wouldn't lie. I would start laughing. Yeah. 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 Antique coin. I really hope I go back to the Baker State. Because, uh, I'm getting all these coins and shit, and I don't... I don't know what to do with them. Mia, why are you fucking making these noises? You're not even hurt that badly. Me, you're starting to make me a little uncomfortable. A little uncomfortable. What's this? More bombs? Don't mind if I do. Ethan, I'm here to save you, buddy. Evelyn, stop it. Don't bad. You're in trouble, little missy. Okay, what is it? Ethan. Ethan, you look uh you look uh not too good over there, buddy. Ethan. Hey, shh, I know, I know, I know. I'm not gonna hurt you. Hell I'd never would have if I could have helped you. But what do you mean? I'm no killer son. Neither is Marguerite, nor my boy Lucas, or even Zoe here. I think Zoe doesn't like me. That girl, Evelyn, she did this without 
is she? Now, what did she do to you? Where are we? Are we like in a in an Evangelion like mind place? What are we doing? That's what she calls it. Hey Zoe, no hard feelings, right? We're, we're still cool, right? Everything changed after that. So she infects you and then she takes control? No. Not exactly, Sog. She just... She forces her way into your mind, your soul. You can't fight back. Oh, I feel so bad for Jack. You are connected to her. Can't resist the urge to. This is a nice little southern family with that hospitality. You're a different person. And Evelyn just came and fucked it all up. Aw. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, uh, the girl just wants a family of her own. She's the key. Alright? You find her. Man, Zoe must really fucking hate me. <laughs> like, oops, sorry, Zoe. Again, stay away from him. Why? He doesn't love you. I can make him love you. Don't, don't hurt him. I do I love her. I'm not gonna hurt him. I, I came back for her. Remember? How do I? I don't. I don't like staring at staring at this goop in front of me. It makes me uncomfortable. Uh. There's no time. You have to get out of here and find her. Here. Uh, Evelyn. Take this. Wait, wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Saving your life. You need to go. I won't be able to resist for much longer. No. Now go kill that little bitch. No. No. Mia! No! Alright. You could at least give me a gun or something, Mia. Evelyn tissue sample. Okay. How the fuck do I get out of here? Okay, you little bitch. What the fuck are you? I would like a gun, please. I would like one gun. Can I not? Oh, what the fuck is that noise? What? It's all your fault. Why is it my fault? You're the one that called me to bring- You're the one who brought me over here. Oh, wait, what? Did she- She took the boat all the way back to the house? These woods look really nice, actually. I actually kind of look like the way these look. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just looking at the environment. We're back in the bayou with the crocodilies. Oh shit. <laughs> I thought I saw the water move. Yeah, I did see the water move, scaring the shit out of me. Here in the bayou with all the crocodilies. What the fuck are- oh, these are fish. It's a helicopter! We're saved! I can't run. I can't run. I don't like this feeling. Let me up. <laughs> no. I don't like this. I don't like being in the water. Get me out of here. Oh, 
All right. I don't... I don't have a knife. I'll come back for you, you little sexy son of a bitch. February 19th. Did I say 19th? My bad. February 18th, 1892. There was a collapse in the in the Peterson Mines. Twan? Twan? Twan and Beckford are dead. And Huxley. Huxley? Will never walk on his own again. Oh, shit. The old man stand was right. The ground there is too unstable. The company's not going to send us any replacements. They want us to work double shifts instead. I can't wait to go back to the old country. Oh, shit. What is this? Amber Crombie. Salt mines. Oh. Okay. Are they watching us from that helicopter? Wait, what? Wait, that helicopter come... Wait, that's not the first time the helicopter's been here? Okay. An SOS. Oh, look at this. Oh, and these are the same cages if I were to... Okay. Alright, hold up. You've taken me as things. Okay. She instant transmissioned them to me. Where's my knife? <laughs> There's the knife, but what about the survival knife? There we go. Let me go get that bobblehead before I forget about it. Eh. Eh. There you go. Now that I got my, my big man knife, I feel like a big man. And then this is what, the Magnum? Oh, fuck, are you kidding me? I'm still missing two? Damn it. <laughs> That's a lot. All right, so where's the good gun? Standard. Where's the, uh... Relatively powerful handgun. Where's my shotgun? Do I need to bring the burner with me? Uh... No. I will bring these bombs, however. My first aids. Uh, chem fluid. I got a shit ton of handgun ammo. And then here's the machine gun. Machine gun ammo. Corrosive. They can dissolve certain metals. I'm not sure if I can use that over here. I might be able to. Do I not have any shotgun shells? Let me go to sort. Here we go. I don't have any shotgun shells. How the fuck do I not have any- Oh, I used them all during the fight with Jack. God damn it. Alright, well fuck. Guess I'll- I'm not sure- I don't think I need the grenade launcher right now, do I? Do I even have ammo for it? No, I don't. So there's no point. Got a shit ton of handgun ammo though, so I'll bring that with me. Um, separating agent, gunpowder supplements, um, I'll keep the Kim in there, right, and then enhanced ammo, we really don't need that one thing of bullets, lockpick maybe? I'll put away some bullets. I'll put this away too. Oh, you can't store that. Alright, well, fuck. Psychostimulant, I'll put that away. For right now, I'll put away the shotgun and the knife. Fuck.
Um, shit, I think, I think I'm good for now. Yeah, I think we're good for now. We might find some shotgun ammo. Fuck it, let's bring the shotgun with us. Fuck it. It just makes me feel safe, makes me feel better. All right. Gotta tell me twice, I'll shoot that bitch. Right in her fucking face. She been putting me through hell tonight. And yeah, in the past couple of nights. And then she's probably gonna put me through more hell in the DLCs or some shit. Oh. Burner fuel. Burner fuel? Why are they giving me burn- Oh shit. Am I gonna need to start burning shit? Oh man. I don't wanna- <sighs> Fuck it. Let's not worry about the burner fuel right now. How about that? Oh, there's gonna be shit in here. Still got the enhanced ammo, right? What's the- Mag ammo. Fucking hell. You're giving me shit that I don't- that I'm not gonna use already. Fuck it. We're here, might as well just dump it. So I can have some space. Might as well just do it. Fuck. One bullet. Yippee. There's the chem fluid. Which I will use that for... you. Nothing... Oh, strong can fluid. Don't mind if I do. I would like to have some shotgun shells, please, if you if you'll be so kind. Oh fuck. Alright, they're just sitting there. Come on, bring it on, bastards. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Move! Good. It is... It is... I know it doesn't look that, that difficult to aim, but it is kind of difficult. Especially because their fucking heads move so goddamn much. Oh fuck, I didn't even see you. We have no more... No more good bullets. I'm trying to keep my composure. I'm trying not to panic here. Ah, fuck. Oh, come on. There we go. Whew. That is way more tense than it looks. Damn, that was a lot of you guys. More chem fluid. I'm just gonna keep using that to get some heals. You know what I mean? 
Strong can fluid. Where'd I put my... I put away the knife, didn't I? I put away the fucking knife like a goddamn moron. Handgun ammo. Well, at least it was an even trade. Shotgun shells. Make me feel right at home. Now that we have our problem solver with us back in action. I'm just checking. They like to hide shit. Strong Kim fluid. Down into the mines we go. Down into the mines of Moria. You know, I have the I ha oh fuck, it is really dark down here. I have the uh the Lord of the Rings like Blu-ray trilogy extended edition box set, but I've never watched the extended versions of those movies. I need to do that at some point. Maybe later today, if I have time. Sit down with some ice cream. Watch some goddamn Lord of the Rings. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright, see, now you're just a pain in my ass. I was gonna try and save the shotgun ammo, but, uh, you're just, you're just not fun to be around. And now there's mines and shit down. Is Lucas down here? I got a shit ton of handgun ammo, so Lucas, you better watch your goddamn ass. I should have brought my fucking knife with me. Should have brought my goddamn knife. Shotgun ammo? Burner fuel, fuck you. I hear things moving. That's a big boy. That's a big boy. Got that mean fucking strong arm. Oh, run, Ethan. I'm like a wild animal. The more you put me in the corner, the stronger I become. Fuck. There you go. Didn't want to waste no shotgun on you guys. Especially when I got all this lovely space to deal with you. I gotta reload. Fuck. Note to self. Check ammo before you shoot. You may not have bullet. Bullet may be gone. And then you will get big, ouchie. Like that. Oh my god, I was blocking it. You still hit the shit out of me. How many fucking bullets do you take? Holy shit. Oh god, you're like a fucking... What are you? <laughs> what are you? Like a goddamn elephant or some shit? Even an elephant one went down after that many shots. I'm assuming an elephant would go down after that many shots. Let me use this. Put that that goodness all over me. Make it nice and wet. Wet. <laughs> Put a lot of essence on it.
Heading down to the tunnels. Oh, look at this. Look at this point of no fucking return. Uh, I have zero idea as to where the fuck I'm going. But all I know is I now have more confidence. Wait, was that a mag ammo? What? what the fuck did I just pick up? Mag ammo? Damn it! I thought it was shotgun. Oh. Never mind, fuck the shotgun. Now I got a bunch of confidence. Do I have a quick... Oh, it's down. I got eight of those bad boys. Where? Oh, okay. Nope. Forget eight of them. We now have seven. Pain in my ass. You're still alive, aren't you? That was some quick thinking on my part, if I do say so myself. What the fuck? Bastard. You literally just spawned out of nowhere. Well, there goes the shotgun. Any shotgun shells on here? Oh, look at this. Just give it a little push. Just need some guidance. That's all. Oh, I probably could have probably could have crushed them with that. God damn it! I should have saved my shotgun. No shotgun ammo here in the corner. No. Not even like a complimentary shell. Not one shell. All right. Well, I'm taking this out now because they seem to be throwing a lot of things at me, and I don't appreciate that. I like that the place is nice and bright, but they make it, they still make it kind of terrifying because it's all claustrophobic and shit. It's nice and bright, but you have nowhere to go. Oh, what the fuck just hit me? Oh, was that a fucking... Oh, damn it. That was a goddamn mind that I just so happily ran into like a fucking idiot. And now we got exploding boxes too. Nothing that's gonna attack me in here. You know, it's nice that you gave me some some healings, right? But uh, I would prefer like maybe six shotgun shells. You know, something, something to help me ease my nerves. All right, Friday, January sixteenth, twenty fifteen. Thanks to you guys, it's been. It's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal, and she still thinks she's got me. You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Mom and Dad are still totally under, though. I was wondering if this whole family obsession is something you guys programmed into her. It's kind of fucked up. <laughs> so you guys, y'all yeah, some sick son of a bitches. That bitch Mia is still somewhere in between Evie La La Land and reality. She's getting pretty violent, so I locked her up in the cell. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia's her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She actually goes to visit her sometimes. She thinks Mia's her mommy. Like I said, your bioweapon is fucked up. <laughs> Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She makes everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the streets to add to her, freaking sh her freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of Mia not coming around, but it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone comes... Or someone new comes along. By the way, 
Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly and she's getting gray hairs. Is that supposed to be happening? It's almost like she's getting old all of a sudden. Ah, oh, Lucas. Lucas is working for Umbrella. What a cunt. Wait, if he's not affected by Evie, then wait, does he just have like the powers Evie gave him? Because he still regrows his hand and shit. Uh, okay. The report details symptoms that appear when the bacterium that grows inside the E-series affects a human. Be sure to read the document thoroughly before dealing with E-series we weaponized assets. Hereafter, referred to as mold. Initial infection... The mold ingests nutrients from the subject's body to propagate itself and slowly take over the cells within the body. As a side effect of this, the infected subject gains remarkable regenerative abilities. During experiments, we removed arms and legs from the test subject and found that they were able to cope the the amputated limbs in a matter of minutes. Mind stage, uh, mind stage, mid stage infection. Once the mold reaches the brain, the subject thoughts become in tune with those of the E series asset. The subject starts to hear things and experience hallucinations and soon comes under the control of E series asset. And the state continues, the host will lose all the sense of ego. Complete infection. After every cell in the body has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutation differs from case to case, but all results is the same of her acquiring incredible wait what results in him or her acquiring incredible physical strength containing a subject at the stage would be extre extremely difficult yeah because well i killed two of them and i guess i guess zoe didn't fully turn so but lucas still has so is what stage is lucas at Five minutes after dose vomiting. He narrow talk his E-Siri dosage test. Twelve minutes after dose cells. What? Cell, cell calphys. I can't even say that fucking word. I'm not even going to try. Ten minutes after dose's death. Okay, so... If we... Cure the... What? So once they're too far gone, if we cure them, they die. That seems important. Wait, can I read the back? Hmm. Alright, Evelyn functions also include the ability to form organisms in mycelia. Mycelia? Oh, the fungal... The fungi filament. I can't even say that word. The term organism is used loosely here, strictly speaking. They are super uh, superior organisms found of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that, the ex is that they exhibit strong survival instincts and will, will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battle potency. Potency? I just added that word. Potential. The researchers have been calling these superorganisms the molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shape. Oh, so talking about the enemies and shit. Okay. The treatment of the accidental infection performed on samples of Evelyn's body tissue procedures, a unique fungal serum. Administrating the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify. Cal that's how you say that? Calcify? But if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Since the treatment window is small, the serum primarily uses therefore disposal of infection infected subjects rather than a cure. Ooh, okay. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subject sub, uh, subjecting it to meh would, in, would enhance its effects to extremely to extreme potency, becoming a compound we now called E neurotoxin, which meh in even tiny amounts. What's been interesting to observe in Elvin's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to act as her mother or father, treating her as she was really their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as the theme of her mental control? 
This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that the family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort of might... A sentimental sort might suggest that she's making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantined upbringing, a parent's love. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, there's fucking seven pages. Holy shit. <laughs> this potential was in... Uh, this project was in... Uh, instigated in 2000 as one of the surreal concepts of the okay hold up i'm just gonna skim through this there is a lot here working with technical sentence develop with bioweapon neutralized combats uh, later folded all the assets driven the project make sure the project uh markedly different from coming in weapon okay turning enemies into allies gotcha it's effective in the cause is not only prisoner of war handling but combat itself what is it? Uh, organizations chopping the bodies gone on board. Project would never have existed were it not discovery and blah and blah. The remarkable progress, vagrant evolution fungus that we commonly term as mutamycite. I can't even say that shit. What the hell? The application method of which bioweapons was indulged. Blah, blah. Stage 4 human embryo performed cultivation in a controlled environment over a period of. Okay. Referring to as candidate specimen and granted basis of use, by the way. Series A through D to perfect E series. Common common appearance was selected for the bioweapons. Okay. Blend in with refugees. It's a bioweapon that's supposed to be stealthily used. <laughs> like what the hell? Learn about the mechanisms which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the work theory is vector similar to using okay. Alright. Almost immediately after affection, the subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she is not in fact there, even her voice, which is inaudible to everyone else. Okay. Uh, Phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring comp uh, companionship or assistance. She begins to make more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks on other people. Okay. Induces her help to break down the mine. Barriers, brainwash, and effect as progress throughout the body cells of the body, blah, blah, blah. Alright. I just had a nice fucking... A nice goddamn, like, five-hour class in a span of fucking ten minutes. What the hell is this? More serum. Okay, you know, talking to destroy cells, the subject, a survival model, toxin must first be stimulated before, wait, what? Stimulated before use. Do this by place of sample of E-series colon to the, oh. So her tissue. That's what the body's for, oh. So Lucas just had like a backup one. Just in case shit went haywire. Got it. Is there anything in the sink? Damn it. Hmm. What's this? Flame rounds? I will take those. Nothing over here. Really would like some shotgun. Oh, narrow rounds. Thank you. They keep giving me burner shit. Do I need this on me? Oh, I can't put that away. I got a mag ammo, which I'm not going to use. I'm going to replace that with... Uh, let me sort this out. Place that with... An actual stack of handgun ammo. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll need the neurotoxins. And as for the lock picks, ah, uh, they can stay. Grenade launcher, though. I 
don't want to get rid of the shotgun because, you know, it's really useful. Hmm. I'll get rid of the lockpick for now because they keep giving me... They keep giving me burner fuel. So, I'm assuming they want me to use the burner. Alright, we should be good. Oh, but then I can't pick up shotgun shells. Oh, fuck. I will, uh... Shit. Something's gotta give. Something's gotta give. I wanna get rid of the neuro one, cause... Ah, eh, fuck it. You know, once I use the- once I use the item, right? Once I use it, it'll open up space for me, so that's not too bad. Everything's reloaded. Nothing else here on the wall, nothing under the chair. Okay, nothing under the desk. I think they are setting me up for some sort of battle. Oh, I just cracked the shit out my back. I just cracked the shit out my back. That felt so good. Alright. Where the hell am I? What's this? Enhanced handgun ammo. Fuck me. I would love to have that. I would love to have that right now. What about this? What is this over here? Nothing. I'll come back for these for these bullets later. I'll remember them. It's kind of dark over here. Making me uncomfortable. There's a bomb. Some chem. Ah, shit. I might have to... No, I have the burner with me, right? It's... You know, it's full. I'll fucking... I'll put away the burner fuel. I'll put away the burner. I don't need it. I'm confident in my abilities. I don't need the burner. Famous last words. I don't need the burner. Give me this, though. I'll need that. I'll take that so I can do... I can do this. I'll, I'll open up with the uh, enhanced ammo. Get some good hits in there. Oh, why well, gotta be water? I gotta be all watery and shit. Now you're making this difficult for me. Is Evelyn singing? Alright, you crazy bitch. Where are you? <laughs> Get ready for a jump scare. I don't like the fact that you stopped saying- oh fuck. Evelyn, we- Evelyn, we can be friends, you know? We don't have to do it like the- oh fuck. What's this? Fuck. Oh! Out of my way! Huh. Ah. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Let me through. Let me through. You won't let me through. Where the hell am I? I'm still stuck. Bastard. You don't even got no fucking arms. And you're eating bullets like it's nothing. I don't need you chasing me all the way. So I'm just gonna deal with you here. How many fucking shots are you gonna take? Holy shit. Fuck. 
fucking hell. Ow, you did a lot of damage. Holy fuck. There you go. It's okay, I'll just eat on some leaves. It's fine. I'll be fine. Fuck it, I'm just gonna use this. It's gonna be way faster. <laughs> You're laughing at me, it's not funny. Really, dude? Really? How many- Oh, fuck. There's a fast one, too. Move it! Ugh. Right on, bitches. Yeah, you like that. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh, fuck. I'm at red. Put that juice all over me. Oh, fucking hell. What's in here? Shotgun shells. You know how to make me feel good. You make me happy. You, you make me happy. Die, bitch. There you go. Oh, come on. You did not eat a whole shell to the face. Well, problem was solved. Time for you to go back where you belong. I will take that. Did I take it? I did. Making sure. Equal exchange, equal exchange. <laughs> You're not fun, Evelyn. Anything behind me? Dead? Still alive. Alright. And you got a friend, that's cool. That's fine. All right, well, there's too many of you. How about how about this? How about we settle this now? Oh fuck. And back to the tunnel. Good. You know, Ethan, it would be nice if you can put up a little bit more than a fucking Sunday night jog. Where are they? The fuck is that? No, I thought that'd be an item. I hear noises. Bad noises. That's a bad noise. That's a big dude, and it's a bigger dude next to the big dude. That's a real big dude. Uh, let me up. There's your neuro rounds. Oh, fuck. Is he dead? Oh fuck! I'm stuck! I put my- I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. Oh fuck, come on! Huh. Run, Ethan! You know, your projectile vomit is a pain in the ass. Got him, though. Burner fuel. Burner fuel. Strong first aid, thank you. I'll take that. And what did I run past? Oh wait, is there anything in here? 
Ah. What did I run past? I ran past something. On this rock, maybe? Oh, first aid. Thank you. Holy shit. Where am I? Yellow? Fuck it. Eat that. There you go. I think that's it for- wait, hold up. I thought there was something over here. Well, that went way better than expected. I'm guessing that was supposed to be like a makeshift mini-boss or something. Where the hell am I now? Oh, a little crawl space. Perfect for a jump scare, don't you think? Huh. Machine. Strong first aid. Mind map. There's more? Okay. Well, I think we just went through the worst of it. I would hope that we went through the worst of it. Open up! Yeah. Oh! From the first... Is Grandma's chair. Oh, yeah. Grandma's Evie, I forgot. Evie is Grandma. I knew there was something with Grandma. I forgot what Grandma was. Oh, fuck. Is this the door you were talking about over here? It's kind of fucked up when your house leads straight to a to a goddamn mine, I would be kind of creeped out. E001. Grandma. Oh, yeah. Grandma. I'm here for you. We can talk this out. Hello? Pizza Planet? I would like an extra cheese. Double pepperoni, please. You're not gonna... You're not gonna... What? Oh, wow. I'm gonna take that back. I'm, we're just gonna let's pretend that we that we didn't do that. Let's pretend that I didn't shoot you. Okay, cool. We're just gonna just gonna go just gonna go this way. This is when I killed her, huh? This is when I killed my wife. For this is your fault. Nothing's my fault. You better stop that. You better stop. You better stop doing what you're doing. And I better start grabbing as much good things I can do. Things with good ammo. Things that hit hit hard. Am I gonna get jump scared in here? All right, Evelyn, we can we can talk this out. We can be good friends, you and I. Just tell me what you want. Listen, you just tell me what you want. I'll Ethan, it's okay. It's okay. It's me. It's not okay. No, you didn't. Mean you did this before. Kill him, mommy. You're the one who told her to do this to me. Have done that. <laughs> Daddy? Then he can die. 
Why are you so mean? Now it's mommy's turn to kill you. What do you mean? Is she still is Mia still out running about somewhere? Are we I'm going upstairs, aren't I? The hell you mean help? Ethan, help me. I tried to help. At this point, I just want to go home. Yeah. You really make me uncomfortable now. I can't open the door. Things are getting darker. My eyesight's going. Oh, I can open this. No, I can't. Uh, where, what? What do I do? Oh, fuck! Leave me to die. Oh, I can't hurt you. you. Got me waste my ammo on you. Oh, fuck. Oh. Where the fuck are you? What? I'm... I'm highly confused and scared at the same time. Can't open any doors. I don't know where to go. I guess I'll head downstairs. Can I go back downstairs? Uh. Am I supposed to be? Oh. I don't like how they're fucking with my visibility. I really can't see. <laughs> you stop. Evelyn. I already played nicely. Your hallucination. Go away! Go away! Go! Go! Ow! Okay. Evelyn, you can't hide forever. You gotta take your medicine. Where the hell are you? Where you at, Grandma? Take your medicine. Oh, fucking shit! <laughs> Damn it. You stop it. I don't like that. I really don't like that. That one, that one makes, oh, <laughs> I don't like the doll. The doll is the worst one. Upstairs, maybe? Maybe back upstairs? Yeah, okay, upstairs. Oh, fuck. <laughs> ah, stop it. Grandma, it's time to take your medicine. No. Ow, fucking hell. Take your medicine, Grandma. Did you hurt me badly? I was on red. How the fuck do you do that? Uh, come on, Grandma, you gotta take your medicine. No. Come here. Get away from me. Stop, stop, stop. 
No. Bad. Listen, I'm not a bad person. I just did what had to be done. Grandma, you need to take your meds. I don't hate you. You were supposed to be cool to me. You sealed your face when you locked me down in your, your fucked up sex dungeon. Am I still on red? <laughs> I'm on green. Oh, I don't like that. Nope. I don't like that. I don't like that. I mean, no likey. That is weird. You die. Die, 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 die. Fucking hell. Ow. You were too close to me. It's the helicopters. They're here to save me. What? Reload! Reload, Ethan! Die, Grandma! Oh, fuck! Did you just call me a little boy? Fuck! Help me, helicopters! What the hell are you here for? Oh, wow, that's my leg. How do, where, do I have any? I do. Reload. Ah, fuck. You're a bastard. Can I heal myself? Stop. Stop. I can't even heal myself. Uh. Am I dead? I'm still good. Oh, come on. Use, it. Use what? The Albert O1. Move your move your hands. There you go. Take your medicine. Am I done? Well, it's not a rocket launcher, but it's close. You know, I forgot about that fight. <laughs> All I do is just remember what happens after the fight, which is this stupid shit right here. Oh my god, it's a guy I don't remember. I'm glad we found you. And he says his name is Redfield. It's almost like he looks different in every fucking game he's in. So you tell me that skinny motherfucker. Well, he's not skinny, but you know, he's, he's thin compared to the Chris that we see in RE8. Now I do remember if you if you picked Zoe, Mia actually ends up dying. And Zoe dies too, so. 
Well, quote unquote dies because there's the DLC which I've never played, so I don't know what happens after that. They say that when one door closes, another opens. Well, a door closed tonight. And what a long night it was. But not just for me. Me and I weren't the only victims here. So were the bakers. Yeah, I feel bad for the bakers. Except for Lucas. Lucas is a jackass. But now Evelyn's dead. And these guys are here to clean up the mess. Umbrella. I had just come to terms with losing Mia. I forgot. Wait, what? <laughs> all this behind us. I forgot that you get rescued by, like, a blue umbrella. What the fuck? I forgot there was a blue umbrella. What the hell is this? Okay, I'm guessing these are the credits. Fuck. <laughs> I actually like this version of the song. Oh my god, well... That's RE7. Well, the main game of RE7. We're gonna come back and do the DLCs, like, next week when we have time. But, um... Right now, for, the, for my thoughts for RE7... Uh... It, um, shit. <laughs> I don't know how to. I don't know how to word my thoughts. Well, first of all, it's a good game, right? Um, even though I find the molded creepy, I wish there was still a little bit more variance to them. Which it seems like RE8 is gonna fix that problem with enemies. It seems like there's gonna be a lot of varieties. Um, because the only other variety you had was like bugs. Um. Oh God, I don't like the doll. Oh no. Um, they, uh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, like, put my, put my thoughts together right now. The way they told the story in this game was both good, but also kind of not good. Because if you wanted all the, uh, you, did, you didn't really need to read every document you saw to understand it, but... But there's still some like pretty key pieces of information that's there so if you were to ignore those documents you would probably miss like a good a good chunk of something that you know explains the story but resident evil's always been like that so it's not too bad if you're used to it but um the gameplay itself i it has the same problem as like well, we recently did Resident Evil 4. It has the same problem as that, and, like, Resident Evil 2 Remake fixes upon that. And that's just, like, maneuverability. Now, they do make up with that with the defense, with, like, the block button, which seems to really save your ass and mitigate a lot of damage. But at the same time, there's too many times where you get stunlocked. Like, because you get hit, then Ethan has to do his animation of him getting hit, and then you can just get fucked up in a corner... Um, there's no real way to, like, move past enemies if you get stuck. You just gotta kind of pray that you can squeeze on through. Um, I wish there was an easier way to use the, uh, use the inventory on the fly. But, um, it doesn't seem like that, you know? It doesn't pause the game like the attach A case or anything like that. But, for right now, we're gonna skip the credits. If I can. Yeah, we're gonna skip the credits. Because I gotta fucking use the bathroom. And we gotta end this off. So, real quick. As always. I wanna thank everyone for watching. And I'll see you 
in the next video. I really gotta use the bathroom. Sorry for like a lackluster, uh, a lackluster ending, but uh, I gotta go. So thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you guys next time. I'm a chef, chef too.